We are students of Netaji Subhash Institute of Technology and this video demonstrates our first effort in making the life for the visually impaired simple. We wanted to build something, something which was ubiquitous, something which was very easy to use and something which could be easily adapted into the lives of the visually impaired. Our project, the Universal Personal Assistant, as we call it UPA, is our very first step in this regard. The device gives the ability to the visually impaired to take everyday measurements like temperature, body weight with the least amount of physical inputs and the most efficient verbal interaction. This project is being submitted as an entry to the TI India Analog Design Contest 2011 and was done under the mentorship of Professor Dhananjay V. Gadre. We would also like to thank Dr. C. P. Ravi Kumar and Sagar Juneja for facilitating the contest and providing us the resources in adequate time. This project was done at the Center for Electronic Design and Technology at Netaji Subhash Institute of Technology. The rest part of the video gives a demo of the working prototype, the various possibilities and what all additions could be done in the future developments of the product. Thank you. This is the complete setup for our project. Our setup consists of three parts, a wind scale, a microcontroller unit and audio circuitry. A bus carrying analog data from the wind scale connects to the microcontroller unit which calibrates the analog values and sends the output to the audio circuitry to read out the weight in the language selected by the user. The wing scale is a generic digital wing scale which was picked up from a local store. We replaced all the circuitry inside the scale leaving the four load cells intact and replaced it with our own circuit consisting of two INA122 instrumentation amplifiers connected to the load cells. The output of the instrumentation amplifier is then sent over a bus to the microcontroller unit. A button is also included inside the wing scale which automatically detects the presence of a person standing and then triggers the microcontroller unit. We have used the LM3F811 evaluation kit with an ARM Cortex M3 core. The function of the MCU is to take analog readings from the wing scale calibrate it and send the readings for output on the audio circuitry. A FAB32 formatted SD card is interfaced with the microcontroller unit which stores vocal data required for weight readout in different languages. To prove our concept, we will be showing a demo in both French and English later in the video. The audio circuit has three parts, a TLV563612 bit digital to analog converter, a TPA4861 1 watt mono amplifier both of them from Texas Instruments and a 100 kilo ohm potentiometer for volume control. The TLV5636 12 bit DSE and the TPA4861, the 1 watt mono amplifier, are SMD components and have been mounted on the bottom side of this board. For optimum clarity, the audio circuit uses a 15 to 6 kHz bandpass filter to successfully pass all the voice band frequencies and attenuate the rest. The output of the audio circuit is fed into an 8 ohm speaker for readout. Three user buttons have been provided which let the user to select the languages, log data to the SD card and choose the sensor to be used. Now we will show you a demo of a working prototype. With the wing scale bus connected, when the device is powered on, the language selected by default is English. The user then stands on the wing scale to take his weight reading. After a couple of moments, the reading is sent by the microcontroller unit and sent to the audio circuitry for readout. Your weight is 72 kilograms. The user language can be selected by pressing the leftmost user button. Pressing it once selects the user language as French. Pressing it many times can be used to switch between multiple languages which can be both Indian and foreign. Now when the user stands again on the scale, the weight readout is in French.
pressing the centermost button toggles the logging of data. By default, logging is disabled. When the, pre when the user presses it and then stands on the scale, apart from weight being read out in the user-selected language, it is also logged onto the SD card. The log data is stored in a text file, log.txt, which can be read by most operating systems supporting the FAT file format. The rightmost button is used to toggle between the sensor modes. By default, the wing scale is enabled. Pressing it once transfers the control to the onboard temperature sensor.